Hello, hello, and welcome to Healthy Life with Kimmy. Well, hey guys, how is everything going? Today is day 21, day of 21 of the challenge. And of course, I have a tip for you. Today's tip is to reward yourself when you reach a milestone. Take time to, re to enjoy the fruits of your labor, okay? But a word of caution, because how do we typically reward ourselves? So just a little rewind for those of you who do not know, I am Kimmy. I'm on a healthy weight loss journey and I've been bringing you tips every day as part of a 30 day challenge this month. And it's been going amazing. We're losing weight. People are, um, are off of their, some of their medications. Some, um, they're, we're all drinking more water and I'm, and I'm benefiting too. So it's just been great. It's just been great. We're working out more, making better choices. So again, today's tip is to reward yourself. Tip number 21. And again, when we talk about rewarding ourselves, the main way we normally have been taught to reward ourselves is food. Well, we try to reduce our food, most of us, our intake. So what would be the obvious choice or the most common choice, we want to try to avoid it. So instead of opting for a food reward, try something that's non-food related. For example, you may decide, I'm going to go buy myself a dress. I'm going to buy myself a pair of earrings. I'm going to change out my lipstick. It could be anything you want to do to reward yourself. You know, it might be, I'm going to take an extra 30 minutes to do whatever. I'm going to go get a massage or whatever. It's just something different to mix up your, up, mix up your life. As you've noticed on the channel, I've been trying different foods, Vietnamese, Korean, all kind of different things. And I've been taking you on these little journeys with me. I have the Vietnamese video. You'll be seeing that very shortly. But I've been going to different places that I've never been before. You know, just little changes. And it doesn't have to cost a lot. There may be a park you want to go to. Maybe if you do want to treat yourself with a food that you have not eaten in a while, make sure it's just half of it. Or, you know, make sure your, your numbers that day balance out. I'm going to go ahead and have me a whole piece of cheesecake. But I'm going to make sure my breakfast, lunch, and dinner is not the same. You know, some kind of way to compensate that. Because you may want to treat yourself with a dessert or with some food, you know, it might be something you've been putting on because of the challenge, putting back or not, not having rather a better way to say that it may be Coca-Cola. You might be like, doggone, I'm gonna have me a Coca-Cola today. I want a Coca-Cola. So whatever it is though, just think about it, you know, in advance and plan. We don't want everything to go out the window from one food choice that we made. Okay. So again, it's all about mindset and, and pampering ourselves. We don't do enough of that. We don't. A lot of times we'll say, well, once the kids are grown, once I don't have to take care of my parents, once this, once that, no, now's the time. Now is the time to take care of yourself. Now is the time. I am learning that too. Um, I, I have always felt like that. I don't feel, I've always, since I was even like 18, 19, I don't feel like I have to wait till I'm 80 or 90 to try to enjoy my life. And then I see 80 and 90, you may not even be able to move. You may not have the capacity. You may not have the money. You may not have anything. Now is the time to enjoy. So find some kind of way to reward yourself for your weight loss, okay? It may not be weight loss. It may be that, hey, I gave up Coca-Cola all month. Or whatever you chose to do to be part of the challenge. Reward yourself. Again, it doesn't have to cost a lot of money. $5. New lipstick. Change out your lipstick. I always wear this. So I went to Ulta. I always wear like a pink or a purple. I just like it. Been wearing it for years. Always. I went to Ulta and I bought something called coffee. And it's so pretty. It's a lip gloss. I'm going to wear it in my next couple videos so y'all can see it. You might have saw it in one of my previous ones. Because this is in my drawer up here near my bathroom. So I can just grab it and put it on. But that mocha coffee color is brown. It's different for me. And people actually love it when I wear it. And I like it too. I love it. It was like $5. I'll see if I can bring it on and show you guys maybe the next video. But that's the way I treat myself too. Just to buy something. Doesn't have to cost a lot of money. Because right now a lot of people are strapped. You know. But you can go to the Dollar Tree. You know. Again, the tube of lipstick. When I bought the little gloss was $5. So something to just say, you know what? I'm proud of myself. Because you may not hear it. As you're losing your weight, everybody's not rooting for you. You would think they would, right? As you start losing weight, it's going to be so funny. People are going to say, are you sick? Are you okay? Now, you talked about me when I was big, and now that I lost some weight or losing weight, that's still a problem. 
You cannot win, I promise you. Now, I've not had anybody tell me that this time, but in the past, I have had little comments like that. You know, it's like, wow, is that too much? Or you don't eat something. Well, why? You should have that. Well, no, I'm trying to lose weight. So, you'll talk about me because, you know what I'm saying? So, all that being said, today's point is, today's tip number 21 is to reward yourself. And don't pass the roses. Stop and smell the roses. Do something kind for you. All right. Until next time, this is Healthy Life with Kimmy. Bye. And check out HealthyLifeWithKimmy.com. Sign up for the email so you don't miss when I go live. Because starting next week, we are going to have a weekly meetup. I think it's going to be Wednesdays. It'll be here on YouTube so you don't have to show your face. But just tell me what happened the week before. Let's catch up together, okay? Until later. Bye.